Grand Rapids school leaders are trying to figure out how to manage a shortage of nearly two million dollars. Tonight, the district admits some tough decisions will need to be made. 13 on your side's Amr Boss joins us now. Amr, do we know what those decisions are? Well, Nick, so much needed openings in West Michigan's largest school district are now likely to remain open. That's because GRPS is feeling the effects of a decrease in student enrollment. Um, teachers may not teach the same even though they have the same credentials. With two children currently enrolled at GRPS, Tennille Harkness gets concerned when she hears the district is struggling financially. The students are not growing up with someone they went to school with last year. They're not having the same friends, so that does take an a emotional effect on them. Fortunately for Harkness, the district is not planning on laying off teachers or closing schools, but they will have to take other steps. But we're having a tough time with, with administrative support people, secretaries, paraprofessionals, even in our, our uh, operations folks, you know, basic building custodians. But a decrease in student count means those tough times will have to last a little longer. If we need to make staff reductions, we have enough open positions that we can take from the open positions and not have to, um, you know, eliminate any, any fill positions currently. The if is because Lansing has not finalized the state's budget, so GRPS does not know how much funding they'll receive. On Monday night, a budget was approved which anticipates a decrease of about $1.7 million. That's due to a decline of more than 200 students for next year. District leaders blame a lack of affordable housing, school choice, and fewer couples having kids. The model, business model today just doesn't work, and there's not enough money statewide to, to do that. So Now we should know more once state lawmakers make some make some decisions. Leaders have recently said that they hope to finalize the budget by the end of July. Nick. All right. Well